What's up sis? Welcome back to my channel. It's your favorite coach, Coach Jelena, and I'm back in the office for another video for you. Today we're going to talk about how to pretty much grab social media by the balls and finally get social media to work in your favor. Before we get into this video, for the people who may not know who I am, my name is Coach Jelena. I'm a business coach that specializes in strategic strategies for the online presence of small business owners in the beauty or hair industry. I want you guys to go ahead and like this video, give it a big fat thumbs up. It helps the algorithm and it helps for entrepreneurs like you that may be experiencing some of the unfortunate events that comes with running a business it allows my videos to pop up in front of them last but not least I want you guys to hit the link in the description box and join the wait list for an online course that I've been building for the past few months now and by you joining the wait list you'll have access to free content along with early bird prices and all that good stuff when your girl actually releases or launches this course. And you don't wanna miss this. But we're just gonna jump right into this video and talk about how to grab social media by the balls and actually succeed when doing so. So something that I have noticed when working with entrepreneurs, whether they're my students or my clients, I noticed that a lot of you guys fail in this particular field but it's focusing on the customer's experience now we're going to chop that up into two one focusing on the customer's experience and two focusing on actually retaining future customers and i'm going to break that down a little bit for you your website should be easily able to navigate the checkout process for your website should be seamless and there should be a seamless flow from your Instagrams page to your TikTok page to your website to your booking site. All of that stuff should connect and correlate with each other. And a lot of you guys just have stuff everywhere. So that's the number one thing, focusing on the customer's experience and actually retaining future customers. Now that can be associated with more so of a sales funnel when it comes to your business, but you need to have strategic steps put in place to gain brand awareness to actually securing a sale. So that's the first thing. You guys need to get your websites and your platforms, your social media platforms together. And if you need assistance with that, definitely book a one-on-one -on -one session and we can figure out all that stuff together. The next thing is having an actual content strategy. A lot of you guys just post excuse my language just post shit just to post it there's no value behind it there's no purpose in it it's not helping anyone it's not doing anything so something that i want you guys to do when actually creating content for your business instagrams and even content for your website i want you guys to focus on three things planning creation and delivery another thing is understanding what value does your content have or what pillar is your content catered towards? It, are you posting promotional content, entertaining content, educational content, engaging content? In order to allow social media to scale your business, you need to understand the content that you're posting and delivering it in a way that's relatable and engageable to the viewers. Something that I strongly recommend when posting content to your social media platforms is understanding the context of the content and some of you guys are not understanding the assignment always post things that is niche friendly pertaining to your specific industry of business and attaching some type of valued content behind every single thing that you post and aside from understanding the context of the content you're posting you need to decipher what type of outcome do you want behind each post ask yourself what type of content am i going to post why am I posting this content and how is this content going to essentially help me get to my target goal? The next thing that I want to mention is a lot of you guys are not showing up through your content. In order to be successful on social media, you have to show up, but just don't show up, just show up. You have to show up and deliver, honey. You need to deliver. And what I mean by that is showing up through your content, adding value behind the content that you're posting, staying consistent this is a big 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 one stay consistent with your business post every day and if you don't post every day post every other day but do not just go inactive on social media get yourself on a set schedule i understand a lot of you guys are mommies a lot of you guys may work corporate jobs where you have have a traditional just nine to five job and you're trying to scale your business while working a full-time business 
I recommend getting yourself on a schedule, getting you, getting yourself a planner and actually stick to the schedule as if you have the clock in for it in order to get paid. And when it also comes to showing up for your content, you also need to make sure that you're creative behind showing up. The goal is to not mock other create creators out there, but also learn from other creators and figure out essentially what's working for them if they're in your specific niche and then recreating that content but in your own way in your own manner in your own friends voice identity and so forth and the last thing that i want to talk to you guys about when it comes to grabbing social media by the balls and making it yours is is understanding the 80 20 rule out of everything that you post 80 percent of the content that you post needs to be valued don't always sell. Don't always say shop this website at the end of every single caption, every single post, every single story, every single reel, every single TikTok. Nobody wants to see that all the time. Deliver value and then the 20% promote your business. And the reason I say that is a lot of the times regarding small businesses, people want to see the business being operated. And if you're delivering value, you're entertaining, you're using different pillars as far as educational pillars, you're teaching your audience, you're entertaining your audience. When it actually comes time for your audience to show up for your business, they'll do it because you're not constantly pushing shop with me, shop now, purchase now, show up now. You're not doing all those things. You're giving them the opportunity to be interested with your business. So always show up 80% value and 20% promotion and watch what that does for your business. Now, I hope you guys did like this video. If you did, don't forget to give me a thumbs up. If you follow these steps within this video, I can promise you, you will see a, a significant change over time when it does come to engagement, following, converting followers to customers and so much more. Now, if you do need assistance with anything, I do have one-on-one -on -one mentor training. So if you are interested in that, make sure you click the link in the description box and don't forget to join the wait list so you can have access to some free content that will help you in your business for you then to deliver that value to your audience. But other than that, I love you guys and I will see you guys in my next video.